start recording and now my my computer should be like an industrial fan should be terrifying honestly okay wait <laughs> Andy did, oh my god Andy did do basically the same thing as me <laughs> okay so I have OBS running a, a discord stream running and this is and space cam running and this is all over a, a mobile Nvidia video chipset so I expect uh, I can uh, I can cook a midnight uh, uh, a midnight meal into into this thing. But hey, let's let's kind of go ahead and see and see what we can do. So okay, I, I hope I have already given all these puzzles, right? Hmm? Zig, tell me. Is uh, yes. Okay. You are not showing. You're not spoiling anything, though. Okay, I'm not spoiling. Anything. Great. <laughs> because I I checked before, but you know I I'm never sure. I'm never sure. So we'll start with very very simple things like the, the double puppet simple thing. And mm -hmm. well, for I don't know who what's the audience here. I imagine we have people tuning in for the first tournament. So this is uh, a simple example of why the tournament has a metric because. There is this uh, extremely stupid symbol solution, which is just this. And uh, if you let people optimize, if you let people choose what metric to optimize for, say you give them both uh, both symbols and uh, and cycles, then some people can do this, and this puzzle get completely destroyed. So you have no choice but to uh, if you if you want to your design space to be to be easy to design for, you have to give a metric. So that you can tune your puzzle for uh, for a metric, and this puzzle was that was that for cycles, because uh, I like this kind of stuff. This is similar to to the first um, to the first puzzle we had in uh, in 2018. That was uh, electroplating. I don't know. I don't know who was around in 2018, but it was basically the the same team. I like people pulling uh, huge strands, huge strands of. Uh, of stuff with bonders and whatever, and forcing them to build, to deploy them all, uh, them all in one go. This is a smarter solution. In fact, it's twice as fast as the, um, as the other one because it transports two at a time. So we are getting way faster. Now these two Valdos uh, trip a bit all one over the other because if you check like the like here, this is clean because blue never stops. But here, blue has to stop for uh, has to stop for a cycle because it's uh, it's outputting them both, and so here we have a rotate to sync the things up, and uh, this works, but it it cuts cycles. So we will soon see someone who had the same idea, but did it without the stop. Now this is kind of nice because this is a, a simple evolution of the of the double line thing. And this is uh, this is a pattern you see you see in um, in many solutions. So you when you have enough bonders, you bring a stick of your stuff uh, next to next to where you want it, and now your valdos need to travel much less to to do more or less the same thing. Now, of course, not putting uh, you are forced not to put bonders on output square. So there is no way to do the super smart thing of uh, directly putting outputs into into the output zone. So you need to do stuff like this. Uh, this is uh, this is this is this is aperture solution. When we have uh, uh, puzzle heart, who is this guy? Because I remember he having uh, he having a nicer a nicer name, but I can't exactly remember who he was. I don't know. I haven't seen him on the Discord. Who who he is? Who he is? Is this not a valid comment for everyone, Zig? Who? Everyone has who, I think. Huh? Sorry, which... Uh, let me go look where you put that. Is this uh, tournament oh. host only? That should be allowed, but maybe I made it host only back, so check it in DMs. Great. No, 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 I... Ah, uh, damn it. You guys are seeing, uh, seeing space cam, right? Please tell Sorry. me you're seeing space cam. Yeah. Okay, because I'm calling the bot, and uh, like I, I feel like an octogenarian. Fucking god. Oh yeah, yeah. You're you're sharing only that window. You're not. Uh, you're not. 
Yeah, because I'm calling the bot and there is like all kind of shit in this uh, in this screen. Yeah. Uh, I wanna show that. Yeah, oh, okay, it's uh, it's Mectomus Prime. I've seen him around. And this is the first of the of some pretty complicated solutions. And this does bring make sticks. And then bring some all in one go. Well this is faster because you 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 fuse stuff all in one go and then do just a little bit of travel. And we kind of have uh, an Opus Magnum like thing where this Valdo just uh, just throws commands in, and this Valdo does uh, does all the movement. The thing is that this uh, has a uh, has a good amount of, of wasted cycles in this uh, in all this move around and stuff like this, because maybe six isn't the ideal the ideal number. Maybe four could be more uh, more simple to do, and we will see stuff like that later. Four hundred and twenty-two, still uh, still on the fourth. This is a concept we have seen before. This just shaves uh, a few cycles of initialization somewhere. And this is by... And this is by Lilkov. Now we have guilty by standard. And guilty by standard again does the same thing, but he double pumps the same stick. And this shaves yet, uh, yet some more initialization cycles, because you have two valzos that build, uh, that build the sticks that go on. And so you can uh, you can start doing the loop uh, the loop sooner. And in fact, as we can see, we have all these 400 and something solution that are all very close with people with people shaving uh, shaving initialization as they go. Now we have this one. Okay, and this is an example of what we was talking about earlier. So this is the same concept we have seen uh, we have seen before, but the the double blue weight is fixed because we have here split there is the split but red carries it on and so it is outputted the cycle after and then blue 2 does the split and output and then the drop and output in two separate points and this is an important pattern because you don't waste you don't wait the, the additional cycle and so this is going to be mildly faster than the other one which was, which was this one at 30 cycle 30 cycles worth then what we have here, okay, we have already seen stuff like this. This is double pumped on the same output. And again, bringing, bringing a, uh, a, a double a, a germanium. So it's, uh, it's, just on, it's a sulfur fused onto itself and uh, we'll bring it here. You guys can talk to, I mean, I, I feel like uh, uh, the, the shittiest TV presenter ever. <laughs> Like yeah, this is I think pretty informal, so don't worry about it. I assume it's being recorded though, so. No. Sorry. Is this being recorded? Like we're gonna have a vote of this? I mean, I, I I have put this thing recording, and I think it's recording. I mean, it says that okay. I am recording since eight minutes ago, so I as I assume it's recording, and uh, okay. I can't promise much more. Much. <laughs> I Hopefully mean, this this it. thing is a uh, this thing is a demo, and uh, the the puzzles are shit posts. The the <laughs> bot is updated, uh, is updated daily, and my recording setup is honestly whatever I could found in uh, in three hours, and um, uh, yeah. So about this solution, and I am being very very introductive because I think uh, for for newer pl players it may be it may be interesting to see uh, how one thinks about making uh, making efficient solution. I know that. Like veterans, uh, I don't know. We have Sir and we have Darius here. I've already seen this a billion times, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to be instructive. And here we see again the the output and uh, and the split and output, and then the drop the the output related to the drop done in two different cycles. So this never need to stop and can work in, in continuous cycles. You would like this to be a line, but of course you can't fit all these all these symbols in uh, in just in just this small path. Otherwise that would save you a good amount of cycles if that was possible. And what we have uh, Okay. Oh yeah, I've just said you would like this to be a line. Well, this is a way to make it a line. So this is a pretty smart solution. Honestly, so I missed that. exactly like what I had, <laughs> I think, at some point. Yeah, this looks really cool. This looks really Down cool. Down to the same blue shape. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for real. For real. Because uh, this is an yeah, extremely, say... extremely minimal loop. Man, this looks so cool. I, I dismiss it when uh, uh, 
when checking out of the solution. Because I think this is new. This is by this is by Carset Flames, and I think it was uh, it was made very very soon to the deadline. So I missed it when uh, mm -hmm. when doing rounds. And yeah, it's cool because you never touch ne neither the never input nor the output, and you you have this going back and forth. Ah, looks great. Looks great. Uh, now we start with okay. This is a solution with uh, the same concept. I am not exactly sure where this saves uh, one or two cycles of latency, but I mean it, it does the. Uh, oh yeah, it's clear because it does. Uh, it does a splitter earlier, yeah. So you only need you only need this part of the splitter to be on output. So you can do everything one cycle sooner, and that saves you. That saves you time. And in fact, this is again a 400 solution. We see all the way down here, these are all the same period, but with latency refined and refined and refined and refined and refined. And they all tend to be pretty light on symbols because this kind of things don't, uh, don't need many symbols. You are just bringing stuff over. And here, oh my God, no, <laughs> this is bad. This is bad. I don't Someone like this. This, this. this is just, this is bad. <laughs> This is so bad. he was messing with you. <laughs> he, was, he was messing with you, yeah. This is bad. I mean, I mean, this is this is all the kind. This is all the kind of tasteless. But I I can forgive. I can forgive this. Like you, you just grab know. here. This needn't be a grab bone. And uh, oh my god. Oh man. Well, why this? Wh oh wait, what? that's a cheat solution. How did I miss <laughs> this? How did I miss this? <laughs> you were supposed to delete that. I gave you a command for that. <laughs> <laughs> How did I miss this, guys? <laughs> How did I miss this? Yeah. Oh, well, we, we can watch this. <laughs> I guess we can watch this and say this is why I didn't let you put bonders on output. Because you see, this turns into a completely different puzzle of uh, throwing stuff into the output and then I'm bonding it all together. Who, who made this? He was well, they managed to trick the bot into giving them points. So. <laughs> How did I miss Divorce lawyers. Isn't that a team? <laughs> yeah, it's just a team. That's... <laughs> Oops. To be fair, I also completely missed the that rule for Yeah, I mean but you 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 had excuse you had excuse it because you you were working and, and whatever. Divorce lawyers. Jojo yes. apologized on the space game channel. <laughs> no worries. That's that's fine. That's let's exception. check who let's check who these guys are. They are Link and Jojo. Oh, we, 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 we have, uh, oh, we have Jojo here. Hey, man. Because this was submitted like 10 minutes before the deadline. So I missed it when I, I see Jojo is here and uh, I think he doesn't want, he doesn't want to unmute the mic, but I mean, this just shows that when meat bags are involved in the, into the process, there are, there are mistakes. Like yeah, I, mean, I made this bot and you still put in rules the bot can check. <laughs> yeah, like we have a robotic overlord. We we need to use the robotic overlord. Like that is not uh, Okay, this is this isn't cheating. Oh this looks great. Like I can tell because there is a uh, blue ends up here. So we're going to see oh, something yeah. funky. We are going to see something funky. So blue and red are building something. Cradle. Oh yeah. Oh, oh my oh, it's it is a nine is cycle loop. Is this yeah. <laughs> this is the nine yeah, cycle yeah, yeah. loop. <laughs> always, always Gigigal makes a wheel. <laughs> Man, the nine <laughs> cycle loop. I mean, this is not nine cycles, I'm, I'm referring yeah, to Yeah, yeah, N-E-I-N, nine. <laughs> <laughs> I am referring to a, a 2017. Uh, so, four, five cycle loop putting out uh, two outputs no, this every is, five cycles. This is a four cycle loop, because the pathing is two, this is three. Oh and yeah, this, wait, and three, three, what am I saying? Oh, and that's a four, yeah. Okay. Yeah, and this is four cycle loop. And, uh, so four for two, so it's a, it's a two end solution. I mean, this looks great. Man, this looks great. <laughs> and it, it, this is not even, this is not even as vast. Okay. So it's, uh, it's also pretty pretty okay to show show in television or something. The, oh, yeah. the similar solution, the similar creating solution <laughs> that was done in uh, in 2017 was something like this, which had uh, this nine cycle loop that was extremely tight for that solution and made exactly a swastika. That that was amazing. Yeah. So everyone joked about the nine cycle loop. <laughs> Nine. Yeah. 
Okay. Ninja Girl is not famous for making wheels. Oh, wait, so, no, that was yeah, that I, I really love, I really love wheels, and in fact, that's the reason I <laughs> give. Some fun solutions for wheels, I think too, but very nice solution. <laughs> yeah, that's the reason I give uh, 137 and 37 uh, servers um, outputs. The reason this number is so large is so that you can do pretty funky setups, and it basically only matters uh, your your throughput matters and your mm -hmm. your latency matters very little. And 137 is here because it's prime, and so there is no obvious way of like this was a multiple of five when you would think yeah if I were to put to to bring five atoms at a time maybe I get up no it's prime so you cannot do things like that now this this is bad <laughs> who he is so I so so that I may shame him who is this guy ah oh, man it is so hard. Who, who the <laughs> heck is this guy? Because I haven't learned the teams yet, no way. Oh, it's Lazy yeah, Comet. Yeah, I have to make that who can public. I didn't mean to leave it at so strongly. It's Lazy Comet and username void. All it does is spoil when they submitted on the first round, and that's it. <laughs> so, 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 okay. I, I've just removed the, the extra symbols, and I think this solution does not be funky, so it will be fun to watch. So we make three stick, a uh, three stick. Oh, yeah, this one's nice. So we make a rectangle, we bond it here, sorry, we fuse it here, and when we split it there, oh yeah. Yeah, using that bottom input is a nice pattern. Um, yeah, so this is nice because they... They stay out of the way of, of, of each other because you need this to be for tall. And uh, it makes these rectangles and uh, it puts them out. Looks pretty smooth. Looks pretty yeah. smooth. And not needing to use all three on the alpha input makes it a little bit easier to time things if you use that beta input for the bottom corner. Yeah, yeah, because pulling everything out of here seems unrealistic. Look at the, how tight mm -hmm. the whole thing is. And I'm pretty sad This you need this complicated array just to make that I delay. Like it looks it looks bad. These are three points of delay. Might also be related to crashing. Sorry? Might also be related to molecule collisions, why it has to be set up in this way. Yeah, yeah, I was I was just thinking like there's got to be a way a better way of probably yeah of doing this. Back, maybe. Uh, yeah for example this could be this could be done could be done like this. <laughs> and now I don't need this anymore. No. Oh, yeah, yeah, right. Yeah. Because nice. I've removed one from here and uh, moved yeah. this one back, and so I need less shit. And I could do this because uh, I had space here to. Yeah. Made your solution better. I mean, it's just it's just symbols, but don't see why not. And now we have this solution. And this combines uh, a stick approach with a, with, a fuse, uh, with a fuse split approach where he makes the start of the stick and then fuses and drops it. And this is the advantage that your loop uh, is basically reduced, uh, reduced by one because you can, you can grab here and, uh, and bring along. And uh, this sadly saves very little because uh, with a chain of fuse and split you just save, uh, you just save a spot. But imagine you had to travel. You had to travel more. Then this would save. Uh, this would save him more time. By the way, this is why the inputs are uh, are where they are. Because puzzles usually have the input uh, into this slot normally. Uh, so in this, the typical single atom input is in this column in the game. But in this puzzle, the you mean in the in the second row instead of the third row? No, no, it's into the, the third. Row. They're usually into the third column. Really? Yeah, you usually see them um, see them here, because it doesn't make much okay. sense usually making you make uh, an extra an extra step. It it's just not uh, not in the speed well, of the puzzle. Maybe the players, but I thought all the main game levels usually put it in the left. I forget. No, I think I think most of the time it's here. But I mean, the reason it is on the on this column it's so that you need more, you need to to do more to to. There is more space between this place and this place, mm -hmm. so that you can do funkier things uh, 
in the middle. Yeah. I didn't want I to put... I also like that you made them symmetrical. Hmm? Sorry? Like the, I, I like that you made the alpha and beta input symmetrical, like, vertically. Yeah, this also was done on purpose, so that you could... They are, uh, they are uh, close enough that you can join them with, with bonders and make some funky things. We would see them. Uh, we would see them later. I didn't make them uh, perfectly touched because I felt like um, that would be too easy. <laughs> no, other than too easy, we would limit you because here you can you can join them with a four stick or you can't or do separate thing, etc. Putting them uh, on the same spot limits you because they are so close. You cannot act on one independently of the Without other. Yeah, yes. like like imagine the the solution we've seen earlier that had those. Um, Two by three rectangles, and you cannot do them if they are uh, if the inputs are uh, are extremely close. Mm -hmm. So three four seven, we are slowly dropping down, and we are getting getting faster now. Team B A G with <laughs> this thing. What the heck? All right, it is simple. It works. Great, congratulations, guys. They found a way to fit in the line. It works. Yeah, oh, yeah, this is this is the line I was talking about earlier, and they made it fit. They made it fit. Yeah, I mean, they had to go all the way to make it fit, but it is fast and it's extremely low symbols. Of course, this is not what we're going for here, but I'm sure Team Bug is a, a more a more symbol focused group, so we will see them uh, come back later. And now we have Tough Up. It is pretty pretty early in the ordering for Top Thought. Um, but he does fun things. So, <laughs> I mean, he is forgiven. Oh. He is forgiven. So he does the same, the same kind of uh, make a stick and then bring it to the few splitter approach. But he does more of them in a single go. So every, every approach pulls in uh, four molecules. And then goes here, fuses uh, two pairs so that they split from each other. Grabs here, grabs here, and then does the brings them out. Wow, that is that is packed with symbols. Yeah, that's uh, because it's fully double pumped, so it's a yeah. ton of symbols. Yeah, in it's this. I haven't pick up that second Germanian though. In this kind of solutions, uh, either you can make the Valdos do two separate jobs, or you need to repeat every single twice, and so the solutions get heavy. But we are getting faster, we are getting faster. And now we have Astro Nelson, who is doing... Okay, we will see this pattern many times. Mm -hmm. This is a smart approach, because you make sticks, and then you fill them, empty them, fill them, empty them. And we've seen this done with just one atom, and this does it with three atoms. And this is pretty efficient, because the, the pathing is simple, and the, and the approach is simple. So this is a pretty good job, and we will see this approach used to great effect later. As you see, we have a five loop here, but there is, there is clearance. So this hints that maybe we can do this with a, with a shorter loop. Three, three, four. Now sure. We have seen similar things, and here we go. This is similar to the solution we've seen we've seen earlier, but this is shifted one. It is shifted right by one, so that the loop is shorter. We have already seen this, and here he saves two two spots. So this is much faster than the one the one we've seen earlier. Three, two, two. GG goal. Gigigal does three sticks again. Oh no, man. Ah, okay, no. this is a six two, stick. Two on a long one. Three, three. This is a six stick, and uh, this is implemented. This is the same solution we've seen. I mean, kind of similar with this six stick that we that we feel, but it is implemented. Uh, it is implemented better to allow less uh, less dead time, and we can see this blue Waldo, other than just issuing <laughs> commands is every once in a while it's dropping an extra output yeah it's actually doing seven per, or four per cycle it is doing uh, let me perfect. check this is one full cycle and it is an extra one per, uh, per uh, full cycle seven. yeah seven yeah so yeah it's from seven. from six to seven it's uh it's pretty, pretty. 
pretty big. And this is the kind of, uh, of savings uh, that you can see only if you have a truly huge amount of outputs. Otherwise, it's not even worth to put, uh, to put this here when this stick nearly ends the, the, 10, uh, the 10 required outputs. Yeah, this, this is exactly uh, two cycles per output throughput. It's a 14 cycle loop and seven outputs. Uh, oh, I didn't check that, quick. but... Yeah, that, that too seems to be like a hard limit that keeps getting run into with like many different approaches. This is still not not particularly fast due to the, all the all the extensive setup you need to do. And now we have the last page. Counterpoint submitted today. So I think I haven't seen this one. So it's new for me too. It makes three sticks. It fills them and the outputs them. This is uh, the earlier solution just had one splitter. This uses two splitter, so I expect there are less collisions and it can be. Yeah, and this can... is the same idea as. Um, yeah. Which do we just see? As as many other people. There are many people with. Yeah, with but it's the same way. as the six stick without the seventh one, but it gets to be tighter because it's double pumping. So I guess it's. Two nine seven. Yeah, it's uh, it's less symbols. Yeah. Because GG Gold was 76 and this is 74. Yeah. And then we have Darius and uh, this is nice. This is a nice one. So, cool. he, <laughs> slow that down. Slow yeah, that yeah, down. sure. So, <laughs> he, so the, he has a four stick, similar to the six stick solutions we have seen. Creates a four by three block and then. But instead of, uh, instead of going all the way, he also combines it with a growing with a growing stick. Now the stick is very large, so it may not look like a growing stick, but this is a stick that's growing on the on the direction towards the right. So this is like a stick approach combined with those other ones where the fus fusion saves one. Yeah, exactly. So just that instead of doing it in two, because we've seen these approaches done uh, done in two lines, this is done in four lines, and so it's way faster. And again, this I am very happy about this solution because it shows you why I chose uh, the input points that I chose. That's an eight cycle loop for four outputs. Nice. Yeah. And by the way, uh, I was talking about this, but I may as well spell out why sulfur. Uh, the reason for sulfur is that I needed it to be an atom with many bonds and sulfur has six, so it's great. But I also wanted uh, the uh, twice sulfur, that is germanium, to have at least four, bonded, four bonds, so that you can keep complex molecules made of, uh, of a doubled up version of the atom. And like carbon would be the obvious choice, but doubled carbon is magnesium, and magnesium just has two bonds. So stuff like this with, car stuff like this with carbon will just fall apart, uh, fall apart here. And that's not what I was going for. I wanted people to to be able to experiment with all kind of bonds. And this one is very, very low symbol for, uh, mm -hmm. for such an advanced solution. And then we have Andy, and this is, in my opinion, the, the, best, the best of a bunch, because I like this stuff too much. I like this stuff too much. <laughs> Look at what it does. Look at how big this molecule is. And now, now that he has built it, Red just entered the the final loop, so the blue, and it bonds two pairs, drops, splits. Drops, yeah. splits. And if you look at this, it does six molecules in one go, because it's one and two that dropped off because of the, of the fuses, and then this two that get split. Yeah. My fun solution is a worse version of this idea, but like, yeah, part of the advantage of this is that those two of those sulfurs just get dropped off for free when the fusion happens, because yeah. they that of their attached, it just disappears. And this is a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, 8. You don't need to have a drop symbol, yeah. This is a 12, uh, a 12 cycle loop. And uh, the two... Six. Another two. <laughs> yeah, and if you see, the, the, it isn't apparent here that there is this two, two cycles barrier. Like, you would think you maybe some some smarter bonder arrangement will let you close this up to, to 10, but turns out you can't. Actually, if we could look at my fun solution next, it's also 288. Though I, I couldn't submit officially because uh, I'm yeah. a bot runner, but yeah. Now, this is this is the uh, British boys, and uh, I wanted to say congratulations to them.
because this is an extremely strong finish for a uh, for a team I, I wait I, I remembered who was in this team and now I don't remember anymore yeah so Brit Boy, Mother Monkey and Monster Race oh, yeah congratulations guys because this is an uh, this is an extremely impressive finish between uh, between many established players so I thought I thought that they deserved the mention and uh, this is a similar approach that we that we've seen but did they, they make two sticks and uh, it's like amazing this is a uh, an eight cycle loop two sticks double pumped so it's two again two super output again i also did something with this but my startup was garbage what did they do with their, for their initialization the initialization is rather good not exceptional but rather good Okay, yeah, it's just time to roll all for things again. Yeah. Like it's also very, very tight because they could fit everything without Blue having to stop one cycle to, to output twice. I did, I did like this pure input and fuse and split loops. <laughs> and, and then we have Team 89. And you know what we've done. The three sticks. And this is four by by four the tightest way the tightest way you can you can do this because you need four tall for clearance for clearance and you need four wide to to go here so this isn't getting any faster than uh, than this might want to mention or yeah we might want to mention the like the reason for the like two cycles per output limit that is basically getting hit by everyone uh which is that like you need one input command, one output command per uh, per output, and also something to like put it in the Waldo's hands and something to take it out of the Waldo's hands. Yeah, Whether you that be by bonding, grabbing, fusing, whatever. Yeah, the the thing you hope to is that you can uh, you can do you can bond two atoms or you can fuse fuse two atoms because yeah, you have two inputs you can save. in one command. So the way you could go beyond. Uh, behind the, the two barrier is to make some huge molecule so that you can share the, the advantage. Uh, I was hoping for things like Andy's, uh, Andy's approach, but apparently it's just, it's just not enough. I, yeah. I was rooting for, for those kind of approaches, but as it turns out, they fall, they fall a little short of, uh, of, this tighter, of these tighter loops. I mean, I guess you can guess what this does. Yeah, could you imagine? Oh. And this ended up being the, the winning idea. Uh, I'm a bit sad. Oh, uh, it's a fast startup because of the because it's double pumped. Whereas the other one was synchronized, so you needed to build two sticks at once and like have them both be ready at the start. Yeah. Yeah, and this is Sir. Sir does something clever. If you see this, this is uh, a, this is clearly a two a two tall. Uh, they make shoot all molecules, yeah. but red starts by bringing over a single sulfur, and then they build sticks. Oh, 137 is odd. Is that the idea here? Oh yeah, oh yeah. 137 <laughs> all right. is odd. All right, sir. <laughs> and he wins, he wins by one cycle. I was wondering how someone got blown. I thought someone had some crazy like 1.9x speed thing. No, like no, no, no. He, for output. he beats the competition by one cycle because he, uh, he puts <laughs> out so the, odd, uh, the odd output one sooner <laughs> than, uh, than anyone else. Yeah, the, the, this was uh, was amazing. I mean, I'm pretty happy. Because, uh, selfie, cause, yeah, this is, this is what like three of us did. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean, if you look at this, this is like, there is this limit, this limit here that starts with uh, with Andy and then goes uh, British boys, Team 89, they just won all all locked uh, behind it. And then Sir has like one cycle less because he has uh, Congratulations, Sir. I mean, do you want to say something, Sir, in lieu of, uh, uh, of the Steam post we used to do about this solution? If you want to keep your voice off the internet, that's also fine. <laughs> uh, I take it for a no. I take it for a no. Uh, so I think we will go, go check out the, the fun solutions. And uh, what do we have? Oh, we have a five wall dop of solution. And this looks pretty nice because it, it splits the uh, it splits the, the input. 
you do not want to split the input in this uh, in this puzzle because then you have to pick up two pieces uh, and then you have to go bond them because otherwise you're wasting two valdos and then you have to do stuff with this oxygen isn't a nice atom so this was clearly not a good approach for uh, for cycles but it lets them uh, uh, it lets them uh, stop one uh, one place sooner and so they they make two with five world but as it turns out this is an optimal you can do this one cycle faster than they do and uh, i'm not I'm not making it, but you can uh, you can make it one cycle faster. Well, we have a nice input island solution. Sure though, right? Like the other one, it's very low symbols and it's still decently fast, right? Might be on the Perito frontier. This is a nice input island one. For who doesn't know, input island refers to a style of solution that has Waldos only in the in the input zone. We were a few puzzles oh, yeah. in uh, in 2015. Uh, and 2017, I think, with this kind of restriction. And uh, of course, the uh, the idea is that you make some big stick and push uh, and push your output here. And this again makes big sticks of oxygen because it's easier to make big sticks if you uh, if you have two atoms instead of one and pushes it over. Nice stuff. When we have okay, this uh, uh, this is like reasons uh, telling us what what effect. Uh, what effect Brookie had in his team, and I think the most important thing Brookie did uh, did for the team was this. Shame on you, man! Shame on you. Well, we had this one. This breaks the rules, but I thought it was cool enough to to show. Oh my gosh! So he brings this over, and it has this two cycle loop, and uh, curiously, <laughs> this is still two cycles. Because uh, it is apparently some limit of, uh, of physics or whatever. But uh, the initialization is pretty much non existent. And so it ends up as faster search, ma many, many less symbols. So uh, if this were allowed, this would have won. Like, I am kind of curious to sue. Wow, well, if this was allowed, this wouldn't have won. So <laughs> there would have been many other different solutions. Yeah, you know, I'm not sure of that. I mean,. Uh, some people submitted. I, I think I got to like 270 just by like doing raw sticks when I had not noticed the rule. <laughs> ah, okay. Some people submitted submitted uh, cheating solutions by by because they didn't read the rules and no one uh, no one did better than this. But yeah, I'm sure you can put like seven bonders here and do some uh, some crazy crazy stuff because at that point you need uh, uh, you need bonds, but then you need just a single debond for like seven atoms. So there is ways to to break the two barrier. And what we have? Oh, this is Gigi Gold. Gigi Gold did uh, spent like several days doing uh, this sort of solutions. They look very cool, but are certainly worse than uh, than he ended up. He, he ended up with, and he makes this H, and then does a fourth cycle loop. Two, two again. <laughs> Yeah, true again, but the setup cost uh, is uh, is massive. Yeah, it's just interesting because like even if you share, even if you do do the sharing, you usually have to pay a cost in like rotating or something, so you lose the two cycles you saved. And, and then uh, we have oh, this is the best wheel. Uh, this is the best wheel we have. This is an older solution of Gigi Golds that is a little bit worse than the other one, and it builds this complete thing. And then it does the weird thing. Uh, Looks great. Yet some slightly more efficient things, like foregoing uh, this atom here, if I'm not wrong. Oh no, this not not this atom here, but like this atom here. I mean, yet some slightly uh, uh, like wheel even all of something. But this uh, this is just not efficient because uh, uh, you still have the true barrier and cannot uh, cannot compete with linear solutions. We uh, were. It looks like a clock, but it's running counterclockwise. This disturbs me. Uh, I mean, there is a reason for that. There is a reason for that. Oh, no, I'm, yeah, I'm sure there is. But <laughs> because, <laughs> yeah, here we are. Uh, let me see. Because you bond here, but if you were to rotate it the other direction, you would. No, you wouldn't yeah, collide. Probably just work out this way, depending on. No, you wouldn't collide. Yeah, you're right. Because if you're... Oh, yeah. 
Oh, it's probably the same. It is probably the same. Uh, you'd have to... Uh, the, the, hmm. Actually, I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, may maybe it works, maybe it doesn't. Probably, yeah. Uh, I don't know. Ah, yeah, because you have red here, so you are rotating this way the yeah. first time, and so you now you are locked in. Like now, now I screwed up everything. Yeah, you, you. This is this is what yeah. happens when you touch uh, when you touch code you don't understand. And uh, <laughs> when we have cards at fame, see, it, oh God. this is shit posting. I mean, I kind of deserve why? it because the world tournament is about shit posting, and this is this right. is shit posting. Passing it is, through the hydrogen pipe. It is fine. It is fine. It is fine. And now, I mean, I guess I can show up the power of the. Uh, of a community edition of Space Camp, this would have taken ages in uh, in 10, 12. I mean, it takes ages even now because my computer is dying. But <laughs> pretty impressive I'll showing. Don't worry about uh, my CPU cycles. I know what we're memeing about, but it's a Raspberry Pi. It's not going to break my electricity bill. <laughs> so here we have I, yours. This, this was the one I did like Andy, and I was <laughs> sad that I couldn't get it as well as he did it, but. Uh, I, I did your germaniums getting implicitly dropped there from that fusion. Because um, that's cool, because then you get to drop it on splitters. And it looks like a spaceship for a second there. <laughs> so I liked it. Yeah. But, but yeah, the idea is that whenever you fuse the atom away, you get to immediately get two free germaniums dropped in on the right, on the splitters without having to move them around. Um, the trick, but it's like <laughs> slow. The point is here. So you fuse, and now yeah. the magic happens here. Here it is. Uh, yeah, in fact, hmm? this is the same as the same dropping po dropping uh, uh, list of Andy. You have two that come off immediately, and then you have two germaniums mm -hmm. that you split out. Yeah, same dropping profile. And because Ideally, this is the all the would have happened well built in the stick, but there just aren't enough users. <laughs> Had to try yeah, yeah, I I just gave I just gave two two and two because I I mean. I didn't really see a need for for four, but maybe. Oh yeah, no, that, there would have been other different things. This wouldn't have been efficient anyway. You could do maybe some better things with four, uh, with three or four pairs of fusers and splitters. Maybe, maybe I should have. Oh well. You have many fusers in uh, uh, in the other puzzle that I cannot remember how it's called. And well, we have this thing by you, which I uh, haven't yeah, seen. Yeah, this was my my fake real solution, or my like what I would have submitted if I was allowed to participate. Oh yeah, this it is a true. Like this is a true Yeah, but my, my initialization was much slower, so it's two eighty eight slower than all the other approaches like that. Yeah, this is uh, I had of Andy and behind everyone else on the. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I think we went through them all. Yeah. Indeed. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for commenting. And. Uh, yeah, now let's see if uh, if I do this. I think no, I do I do this.